have a new task for you. Yes, okay, good. In accordance with guild rules, you now qualify for the rank of journeyman. Ooh, journeyman, let's go. Well. Do I get something with that? The council is investigating what happened at Wellspring Cave. Many of our resources are devoted to the task, leaving our ranks spread thin. There is a related book that needs to be recovered. It was recently loaned to Janice Hasseldor, the Count of Skingrad. I'd like you to retrieve it. I understand this may not seem the most important of tasks, but still, it needs doing. And you are one of the few available to do it. A note of caution. Skingrad is an unusual place. Be prepared for the unexpected. The Count is a reclusive man, and sometimes difficult to see. Hopefully, your status as a representative of the Guild will aid you. Speak with the Castle Steward when you arrive. Okay, let's go talk to Janice Hasseldor. Old Janice, you know, she's always getting into trouble. Okay, Janice, where art yes. thou? Hi there. Oh. Yes, the Mage's Guild, you say? Oh, the Count is quite aware of your presence here. He simply has no interest in granting you an audience at this time. Now that I've seen you myself, I can't say that I blame him. Whoa! Nevertheless, I shall endeavor to change his mind on the subject. Return tomorrow. Perhaps he will see you then. Dude just fucking roasted me. What a guy. What's going on with you? <laughs> I love the little conversations. What's going on with you? Wow. Dude seriously roasted me and then just walks away. Damn, you're ugly, but I'll try and find you a way in. Damn, you're ugly. Speak. You there. I have an update for you. Oh. The Count has agreed to see you, but not here. He wishes to meet you north of the cursed mine outside of town after 2 a.m. It would be wise of you to be on time. Follow the road west out of Skingrad through the high pasture. The mine entrance is south of the road. The Count will meet you just outside it. This guy's serious? That's the shadiest sounding thing I've ever heard. Go to this dark alley at 2 a.m. Make sure to come unarmed. No clothes. <laughs> He'll approach you from behind. <laughs> the Count loves these naked meetings. Where's Shadowmere? Shadowmere! I should really get some horse armor. Everybody needs horse armor. That's the best DLC they ever came out with. Oh. Oh yeah, it has to be 2 a.m., right? I just like to point out the helmet I'm wearing is incredible. I forget what it is, but... Helm of Orin Bearclaw. It is in. <laughs> look at that thing. That's hilarious. <laughs> I look like Predator. <laughs> Seriously, man. Nord Predator. Uh, okay. 2 a.m. So, if my calculations are correct, that is 11 hours from now. I believe. Please. Oh, stop. Might go a little too far. Hello? Oh! That looks like a shady character if I've ever seen one. Uh oh. Uh oh. 
What's going on here? Uh oh, they're necromancers. Leave me alone. What? I thought I was meeting you here. Just in time, mage. We've been waiting for you. I'm afraid I misled you. The Count won't be arriving. In fact, he doesn't even know you're here. We're not about to let the Guild interfere with our plans, for the Count or otherwise. So, you'll have to die. Don't worry. We'll put your body to good use, I assure you. Wow, I knew it! Oh, this guy pulls out a dagger. Crap! What? Who is this? Oh, it's Janice! Janice? This guy doesn't even have a gun. Or not a gun. <laughs> He's missing his gun! Oh, I leveled up too. Hey! He's where's his cat? He forgot his cat. Uh I meant uh, sword. You know what? You impossible fool. What possessed you to think I would suggest a meeting here, of all places? I honestly did not at least think your it was uh, uh, good use at all. Purpose. I knew about Mercator, but not his friends. Now none of them are a threat any longer. <laughs> I honestly would not have met here in real life. Like, who would ever believe that? Do you not recognize a necromancer when you see one? I suspected Mercator was involved in their cult, but was unwilling to move against him without knowing the identities of his allies. Okay. Obviously, th Count this Janice is Janice. At your service. A thank you might be in order at this point. Go on. <laughs> Despite no what the council may think, I've not thrown in with the necromancers and would never do so. You may pass along that message. I was only here for a book. Is that so? Hmm. Perhaps your council has not been entirely honest with you. Do you really believe they sent you here for a book? No, they sent you here to spy on me. They've heard the same rumors I have about the necromancer's cult. Tell your council that the next time they want something from me, they come themselves. They don't send someone under false pretenses. Yes, I see that now. I regret that Traven has involved you in this way. At least you've survived. For now. Perhaps in the future you can be trusted enough to deal with more serious matters. Now our business here is concluded. I suggest you return to your council. Thanks, Janus. <laughs> hey, look, it's Hugh Janus. Um, back to my council, he said. My counsel, he says. These guys couldn't counsel ah, a five year old kid, okay? This guy's welcomed me twice now. I'm gonna be his master soon. Have you been to Skingrad and seen Count Hasseldor? Yes, sir. Saved you, did he? Well, that's a good sign. I must apologize. It was never the Council's intention to put you in harm's way. The Count's unique nature is not public knowledge. The Council wishes to keep it that way. At the time, it was believed that there was no reason to inform you since it was not crucial to the task you were given. For that reason, I was unable to disclose more about his true identity to you. Clearly, that judgment was in error. I apologize. Archmage Traven feared that sending a high-ranking official with the guild might draw too much attention and provoke a reaction from the Count. 
We were also concerned that it might drive any necromancers in the area underground, making them more difficult to root out. We simply wanted to survey the situation in Skingrad. Our relationship with Hasseldor is tenuous at best. The Council has agreed to keep his nature a secret, and in exchange, he occasionally provides us with useful information. As a vampire, the Count has few allies he can trust. He has disguised his nature from most, but cannot hide it from the Council of Mages, so he approached us with an accord. As you have seen, that agreement is under a great deal of strain lately. The Count does not agree with certain policies the Guild has established. It's not quite that simple. Hasseldor is powerful, to be sure. But the Council does not consider him to be a threat. After all, he has ruled over Skingrad for quite some time, without incident. We feared Hasseldor may have been involved with the Necromancers. Thanks to your involvement, it would seem that he is not. At least, not for the moment. We will continue to monitor the situation, but I assure you, we will make no further attempts to mislead you. You best not. You have done your job admirably, and I thank you for it. Your services to the Guild have not gone unnoticed. As of this moment, you have gained the rank of Evoker. Oh yeah. Along with your new rank, please take this amulet. May it help keep you safe in times of danger. I'm an evoker now, boys. Are you ready for it? If not, I understand you've been through quite a bit lately. Very well. There's a research project going on at one of the alien ruin sites on the eastern side of the province. Irlov Jarol is in charge of the project and is apparently in need of some help. I thought you might need a break after the things you've been exposed to lately. You can find Irlov in the Archmage's Tower. He's a good man, but council matters have distracted him lately, and he's been neglecting his other work. Let's go talk to your love. Man, you best... Uh, he better not be deceiving me.